Hi, it's Beth from Sweet Arts Hair Design and today we're going to go back to basics. I'm going to show you how to do a French braid. Now, I'm sure a lot of you know how to French braid, but I'm just going to show you a really simple, easy way to hold the strands. So, I'm here today with Corinne, who's my neighbour, and she's got great hair to show you on, nice and long. But as you know, with a French braid, you can do it on shorter hair, layered hair, doesn't matter. Okay, let's get started. Okay, so to start the braid, I just want you to take a section of hair and for practicing, I'd make it a fairly big section. So the first three stitches of this braid, I hold all three strands, but then I'm gonna show you how I just drop a strand. So actually you're only dealing with two strands at a time. So I think you'll find it a bit easier. So divide your section into three, okay? So put your left section in your fist, middle section goes in between these two fingers here, like that, and then just hold on to that and get your hair all smooth. So you're gonna take the right hand section in your fist. You've gotta keep hold of all three strands at this point. You're gonna take the left section in between these two fingers here. So go across, grab hold of it. Now you can't drop this section yet. So what you've gotta do with this section is just for now, just pincer it, just while you sort your hair out. So you've still got all three strands in your hand. You've got this one running through the middle, you've got this one running through these two, and you've pincered the middle section, which is now your new left section. So again, take the left section, hold it in your fist. Take the right section, grab hold of it, and that's going in between these two fingers here. Keep hold of that one and pincer. So we're gonna do one more time of that way. So right hand section, in your fist, left section, grab hold in between those two fingers and pincer that one. Now, at this point, because you've already started the braid, you can actually drop this section because you'll be able to pick it back up again in a minute. So just drop that section and just forget about it. You're just gonna grab hold of a section of hair and you're gonna add it in to this section that's between these two fingers. So just add it in like that. You're now going to go back and pick up the section that you dropped underneath. So I always just sort of half twist my hand a little bit and oh, there's the section. So if you feel like it's blending into the hair and you can't see it, just literally take your hand, give it a little flick. There it is. Put that one in your fist. Okay. So you've got a good grip on the hair here. So fist, grab hold of that one with these two fingers. And now you can just let go of that section of hair. Just let it go. So now add another section of hair into this section here that you've got between these two fingers. Just add it in. And then again, if you feel like you've lost that strand, don't panic, just flick it up and there it is. So take this section and you can give it a little pull at this point, tighten the braid if you want to. So you've got it in your fist, bringing it like that, these two fingers to grab that outside one, and you can let that one go. So again, add some more hair. Smooth it out with your fingers. Add it into this section here, add it in. Find your section underneath, so flick, got it. Tuck it a bit tighter if you want to. And then you've got it in your fist, two fingers across, and you're dropping that one. So again, add in your section of hair, I'll show you one more time. Smooth it, add it into this section here that you've got with these two fingers, add it in. Find your section, hold it, give it a little pull, and then you're taking these two fingers and you're grabbing that one. So once you get to the bottom, I'm just going to tie a little elastic. 
so I'm going to be selling these in my store soon because I just love these ones because they just don't snap at all, they're brilliant. So just tie the ends. Now, as you know, these braids stay in great for school, really, really good. If it is on an adult, you can go back and just take the sections if you want and just loosen them off a little bit. So just gently pull on the sides. And you can really pull at that if you want, if you want it to be really sort of loose and romantic. And you can also pull on the edges of the braid as well. I'm just going to leave it like that today, I think. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope it made sense. It's quite hard to slow it down because I'm so used to doing it fast. Um, but yeah, I hope you got it. So if you liked it, please subscribe to my YouTube channel, Sweethearts Hair Design. And I'm also on Instagram at Sweethearts Hair Design. Thank you. Bye.